Girl, if you want to know if a guy is a cheater or not, you're going to have to figure out his novelty. Now, most people understand that guys that are in power will cheat more often, but cheating is not just about having power. It's mostly about feeling powerless. And so if you make more than a guy, he'll probably cheat on you. If he is unhappy in his marriage because you emasculate him because of your masculine energy he probably will cheat on you but novelty is about newness so one of the things that i tell my clients as a dating coach is you want to ask him what his goals are and if he's attained them this year or not if he doesn't have any goals please understand there's no newness in his life he's not growing and he's staying stagnant which is going to give him a greater pr probability of actually feeling inadequate which is going to make him want to cheat so that's number one ask him what his goals are number two you want to have when you have a disagreement with him you want to see is he open to another person's viewpoint or not if he's open he's open to new ideas new perspectives if he's not he's staying stagnant again which is going to make him feel inadequate that's why people like on the extreme right and on the extreme left both have a very high propensity of cheating now let me know in the comments like what other ways that you find cheating and by the way don't engage with these guys that are on the in the comments those are the second uh example of what i said guys that are just going to tell you you're wrong and those are cheaters those are male hoes those are moes we don't engage with them that's why you'll never see me engage with them i don't want you to engage with them either the guys that are about something are not going back and forth with women online they are making their money and they are attaining their goals Anyway, let me know what you think and, and what you've seen in terms of cheaters. And if you want to work with me, definitely book a call with me.